German Supreme Command announced at half past 11 this morning the German troops had crossed all the frontiers, that the German Air Force had gone into action and the German Navy had taken charge of the Baltic. According to the call... Have you thought about what we're having for dinner today? Your favourite. Ah, oh, cottage pie. Have you got everything for it? Yes, dear. It's why we went to the grocers. Ah, oh, yes. <laughs> of course. This morning, the British ambassador in Berlin handed the German government a final note stating that unless we heard from them by 11 o'clock, that they were prepared at once to withdraw their troops from Poland, a state of war would exist between us. I have to tell you now that no such undertaking has been received and that consequently this country is at war with Germany. James. Do you think they're watching us? Right now? Probably. Will they? Really? Cameron. Watch this. Pourquoi les chats français ont ils des rétroviseurs? Pour pouvoir voir le champ de bataille. Ton français il est mauvais, mais ta blague elle est encore pire. What did he say? Oh, he, he said my French was bad. No, but my joke was worse. It doesn't matter who you are, where you're from. We all have a good laugh. Corporal Bailey, will you shut the bloody hell up, man? So apart from the lieutenant, he's a bit of a twat, so. <laughs> James. Hmm? Do you think we're winning? Well, we're alive. So I must be doing something, right?
You heading out tomorrow? Yeah. Nothing that ain't routine, though. We have to go south of the Marzia this time. The Jerry has blocked all the other routes off. But you're still going to come back, right? Well, if they don't shoot us on the way there, they'll most likely be polite enough not to shoot us on the way back. <laughs> you know what? Let me give you something. I'll be back for that. Right, boys. You think Mr. Hitler's shitting himself yet? I'm sure I will be when he sees your ugly mug, sir. <laughs> Stop! Don't move! It's a minefield! Get down! Wilkins! 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 Please! Please! Ah, oh, my mother. Now bugger off! Get out of here! Now!
Were you going to do it? I don't know. Probably. There's no point. Death happens to us all, so why experience it early? Why do you have to be so morbid? Well, I'm the morbid one now. I couldn't save him. I tried, Nancy, I promise. I know. He did all he could do. That's all anyone could ask of you. Did I? Is this it then? Is this what? Dying. Is this it? I expected something a bit more dramatic to say the least. <laughs> what? <laughs> You're alive, you big Wally. You must be doing something, right? See you at home, James. What's the situation? Jerry, about 20 metres that way, heading in a bloody fox, or maybe six, maybe seven of them. We don't know. Anyone got smoke? Much obliged. When the smoke goes up, we go up. Preston, fielding, I want you burn round to the left. The rest of us, flank right and move up. You alright, son? Yes, sir. Keep your rifles out the mud. Be lucky. Right, son. Son. Sir. Oh, the summer time has come. 
And the trees are sweetly blooming And the wild mountain time Grows around the blooming heather Will he go, lassie go And we'll all go together To pluck wild mountain time All around the blooming heather Will ye go, lassie go If my true love, she were gone I could never find another Where the wild mountain thyme Grows around the blooming heather Will he go, 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 and we'll all go together to pluck wild mountain thyme all around the blooming heather. Will ye go, lassie? James. 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 What? Were you the only one that came back? I don't know. I got picked up by Charlie Company. Oh. Sorry. I got a letter from my parents today. Said the house across the road got bombed. Luckily, the neighbours weren't inside. <laughs> they say Kings Hall Road got blown to pieces. The high street looks unrecognisable now. Mum's a bit shaken up from it all. They're getting by, I guess. They said they missed chocolate. Anyways, from the sounds of things, we are winning. I don't think it's about who wins. It seems to be about who loses the least. Oh. Well, um... Probably want this back.
through most of the night, London's millions keep it up. The real lights of London are not yet on, but that wasn't going to stop the celebration for a second. James? But for 48 hours at least, rejoicing is off the ration. James? Thank you. 